main component of the M69 bomb, a cheesecloth sock containing specially processed jellied gasoline. When ignited, the gel filling becomes a clinging fiery mass spreading more than a yard in diameter. It burns at approximately 1,000 degrees Fahrenheit for eight to 10 minutes. The bomb was developed by the National Defense Research Council in collaboration with the Chemical Warfare Service. In a demonstration, it is fired electrically from the ground against a wall. For airdrops, the M69 is assembled in groups of 38. The E23 adapter is used in forming 500-pound aimable clusters carried by planes equipped to handle this size bomb. On the assembly line at Mays Landing, New Jersey, the bombs are secured inside the cylindrical halves of the cluster wall. The bomb is held together by nine steel straps attached to release buckles, which are broken open by time fuses within the fin assembly. The clusters are given high and low altitude tests at Edgewood Arsenal with a B-25 loading the 500 pounders. The cluster is released and opened and the individual bombs with gauze streamers trailing drop toward the target. an M1 fuse detonates the ejection charge, which ignites and hurls the gel filling from the tail of the bomb. Another drop of the jellied gasoline bombs. The M69 saw extensive use in the March fire raids on Tokyo and Nagoya. There is also the M47, containing about the same type incendiary material, but packaged as a 100-pound unit. 